NBC7's What's Up is sponsored by Bill Howe Plumbing, Heating, and Air, Flood and Restoration. We know how. I'm Marianne Cushy, and this is your morning update for Friday, October 9th. A woman is now in custody after a six-hour-long standoff with police downtown. San Diego police say it all started yesterday afternoon when somebody called 911 after seeing a woman inside a resident's apartment who shouldn't belong there. She barricaded herself when police arrived at the home on West Harbor Drive in Kettner. An emergency response team was called in and a robot was sent in to search the apartment where she was found inside. She was then taken into custody at about 10 o'clock last night. Now to our latest coronavirus numbers for San Diego County. There's been a large spike in community outbreaks. 19 new locations were identified yesterday. Most of them were at restaurants or bars or in business settings. That makes 32 outbreaks in the past week. There were 291 new cases reported, which is a 3% positivity rate. There were unfortunately six new deaths, bringing the total number of people who died to 819. Well, nearly all of Regal Cinema's more than 500 theaters have now closed their doors temporarily, but seven locations are now staying open here in Southern California. One of them is a theater in Carlsbad. Regal says the seven locations staying open are in markets that just recently reopened, so they want to give audiences a chance to see recent releases. More than 100 dogs have just arrived at local shelters and they're looking for new homes. They were flown in from areas expected to be hit by Hurricane Delta later on today. The Humane Society says the dogs are friendly and highly adoptable. Look for a second chance. Looking, that is, for a second chance in San Diego. Aren't they cute? Well, this weekend kicks off the San Diego Zoo's How Glowween events. Try and say that. Families can enjoy the zoo for the next three weeks with fun-filled Halloween activities. The event runs nightly, Friday through Sunday, starting at 5. All activities and entertainment will be socially distanced and masks will be required. And it was an historic run, wasn't it? And a lot of fun for the city of San Diego. But the Padres 2020 season has now come to an end. The Dodgers completed a clean sweep in Texas last night. L.A. put up 12 runs to the Padres' three. Yeah, it was indeed an ugly end to an otherwise memorable season for this team. So thank you, Padres. We'll continue to bring you the very latest on the NBC7.com and on TV. And you can also learn more on our podcast, That's Today in San Diego, where we talk about the day's biggest headlines in less than five minutes. Stay safe and have a great day. NBC7's What's Up is sponsored by Bill Howe Plumbing, Heating, and Air, Flood, and Restoration. Call 1-800-BILL-HOWE. Bill Howe. We know how. Time for a new water heater? Call Bill Howe, San Diego's most trusted plumber since 1980. So whether you are looking at a traditional tank or a tankless water heater, you know who to call. Call 1-800-BILL-HOWE. Bill Howe. Because we, we know how. how.